What's up everyone, this is Sly for King here, and today you join me for another one of my Open Sunday videos, where today I will be opening up the next of the Pokemon Fall uh, tins. This one is the EVV tin. So, uh, out of the artworks of the three tins, I think actually this one I like the most. Uh, yeah, so, I don't need too much explaining, so I can just dive into it. So yeah, in our last, in our last Pokemon uh Pokemon V tin, which was Pikachu, we did, we did, we did relatively decent. Um, yeah, we did relatively okay. So let's just show off the promo. So there is the uh, EVV promo, and there is the promo code for the tin. And just like last time, you get two Darkness of Blaze, one Sword and Shield, and one Sun and Moon. So I'll be interested to see what we can get this time. Right, so once again, I'm going to go oldest to newest. So let's start us off with Sun and Moon. Very energy. So we got Rare Candy, uh, Wishy Washy, uh, Herdia, uh, Sandile, uh, Rattata, a Snubble, a uh, Mancarita, uh, something like that, a Cutie Fly, uh, a Lily, and a Cosmo Cosmorin? Something like that. Like I said, uh, I think I've mentioned it a few times, I'm terrible at. I, I, for some reason, I just butcher pronunciations with Pokemon cards. It's probably because uh, the amount of Pokemon content I watch to Yu-Gi-Oh! is far, far less. So that's probably why I've got... Um, well, I'm just terrible at naming, uh, naming them. So, Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. So now this is the Sword and Shield pack. So Psychic, uh, Heatmore, uh, Drizzle, uh, Ordinary Rod... Rosalie, uh, Ghastly, Ponyard, uh, Scizipede, uh, Yampa, Pokemon Center Lady, and we have Orbeetle. Oh, sorry, that's the wrong, wrong way around. There we go. So, now it's time for Darkness Ablaze. Just going to move that pack out of the way. Uh, let's go water. Metal, okay. Uh, Simisir, uh, Lunaton, uh, Stavia, Parasis, uh, Lavetta, Gollet, uh, Phoebus, uh, Parleon, Mark, and... Oh, we got a, we got a hollow. It is a uh, Melotic. Personally, I do actually think the hollow... I do think the hollow pattern in the... In the Sword and Shield cards. Personally, I think that's the best ones we've had since black and white. With the, uh, you know, with the horizontal hollow in the middle. So, yeah, I think, personally, that's that's the best hollow design we've had since then. Right, so, last pack. Can we get, can we get maybe a V? That's what I'm hoping. Uh, let's go lightning. Water, okay. Uh, Luron, uh, Simipore, uh, Spike Morph, uh, Wishy Washy, Pantage, Taurus, I do like the other one, not Taurus, Diglett, uh, Skewovit, uh, Stinny, uh, oh, we got something. Hey, it's a full art. It's a uh, Grimmsnore V Max. Wow, so, okay, that's officially my uh, first V Max I've pulled. From, uh, yeah, that's my first VMAX, and the first, well, not the first full art, but, yeah, that's the, uh, so, yes, very nice. Uh, one thing I definitely can't fault Pokemon for is their full art designs, because 
I actually think uh, I actually do wish some, because like you probably can't you probably can't tell on camera, but uh, you know you might be able to tell. But yeah, the full arts with Pokemon they have like they have like really nice textures. Something I wish Yu-Gi-Oh would do more often, like have more textured cards. But yeah, uh, definitely, definitely glad. Finally got, finally got a full art V Max. So yeah, that's good. So that has been an opening of a Pokemon uh, EVV, <laughs> EVV. <laughs> Try and say that five times fast. EVV, EVV. <laughs> you get it. Dear. But yeah, overall that was um, that was a pretty good opening. We got a Melotech Hollow. Uh, we got a EVV. And we got a Grimsnor V. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. So, uh, I hope you've enjoyed today's opening. If you did, then please make sure to like this video and subscribe to know when the newest videos will be coming out. I hope you've enjoyed. And for now, this is Life King, signing out.